What's up guys, Piper here, bring you a bit of a what the fuck is going on video. Um, basically I tried to get on this morning to do arenas, and it looks like Blizzard has just fucked up uh, PvP. Uh, well, actually the broken parts of the game is, there's a 28k cap, meaning if someone was up as soon as the servers were up, and won say, I don't know how many games it would be, like 100 games, something like that, they could have full Grievous right now. If they did that, they'd probably have two over 2k rating. They could have full Elite Grievous gear right now. Which is kind of crazy, <laughs> and I think Blizzard realized this, and so far the solution has been to just remove the PvP vendors. So I've actually woken up, gotten excited, because finally I have something to do, I want to do some PvP, I want to do some, some arenas with my buddies. And I get on, do 3v3s, do this, and I didn't even realize at the time that all this cap stuff was happening when I was doing these games. I thought, you know, we'll do 10 games, I'll go buy one piece, have to wait for the next uh, week to start so I can get more points, and then I'll just work on raiding in 2v2. Um, it was only until about halfway through that I realized, like, what the fuck, there's a 28k cap. I could literally get all the gear today, it, it, which is broken. Like, some people might think that's awesome. Like, yeah, I'll get all my gear. It's terrible because it makes the gear not even really worth anything. Anyone can get it day one. Anyone can hit 90 right now and just get all the gear. I hate the idea of that, of something that someone like me, works towards for like a long period of time than someone who just hits 90 can get straight away. It makes everything like worth less. Obviously, Elite Gear like kind of negates that, but you know. Anyway, so then that happens, but then I'm thinking, all right, well, at least I'll still be able to do arenas. You know, maybe they'll take the points off me if I get more than the cap when they fix it. Maybe they'll do this, maybe that, but who cares? I'm just going to do some arena. I'm just going to do some arena and I'm going to have fun. And as you can see here, 3v3, I do it with 2 DPS and it's a lot of fun. I prefer to do threes with three DPS just because it's my kind of like, just my fuck around uh, arenas. I more take twos more seriously, um, and threes it's just meaty, two mates, going in and killing people. What's what, what what's not to love, you know? But the problem is, everything now in twos doesn't fucking die. Like, I'm not saying like other classes don't die, I don't die, my healer 2v2 partner doesn't die. Resto Druids don't die. Red Pylons don't die. They can heal a fuckload. And I don't know if it's just the resilience that they've given everyone on the two trinkets or the buffs. Basically, what I think's happened is Blizzard has made it's like made the arena balanced to where everyone has full Grievous gear, which means everyone who doesn't have full Grievous gear is hitting each other like wet fucking noodles. Like you, I'm just flinging my noodles at people. Like, just wailing away, doing nothing. It's just this wet, flappy thing hitting their armor. <laughs> it's like, nothing is happening. And, like, when you think about it, like, obviously we're, we're destroying people in this, but think about this. This is a, a, a hand sham, a red pally, and a BM hunter in these threes. We put out insane amount of bursts. And watch how long people live for when we're doing this. Like, and you'll see more later on. I'll, I'll put a few, a few 2v2 games at the end here so you can see what I'm talking about. Games just last forever. And I think, obviously, once you get more get more and more gear, more Grievous pieces, it'll negate that and it'll become even. The only problem is it makes getting the gear fucking painful. And I mean fucking painful. Like, my, my DPS on a BM Hunter is high, but it doesn't matter against healers because their resilience is so high. And oh my god, like, I literally, I literally, honestly, cannot kill a healer right now. In Arena, 3v3, duels, me versus a healer, it's not going to happen. It is not going to happen. And it's the same in 2v2, like, for people versing us. Like, I do my, I do my 2v2 with me as BM and a Holy Priest, because he prefers Holy to Disc. And he does not die, doesn't take any damage. I've done, I think, like, 10 games, and 6 of, the, of those games have gone over the 15-minute mark, where then people are just starting in one shot. Which, again, I'm glad it does that, but it also kind of pisses me off, because... The games become, alright, it's not about killing people, it's about getting to 15 minutes without losing much health. That's honestly what it becomes. It's like, alright, we know we're not going to be able to kill each other. It's the, the aim of the game isn't even to get you to, and kill you. The aim of the game is who can get each other the lowest. And then, to, like, hide away and run away and, like, not take any damage. That's, and that's Honestly, that's what it became. I versed a, an Ellie Sham and a Resto Sham. And an Ellie Sham popped all his burst... And I, did, I wasn't thinking about the 15 minute thing, and I let him get me to like 20% before I even started to like, oh, maybe I should do turns, maybe I should do this. Because I never have worried about it before, you know, I know my limits. I know when I can do this, when I can do this, and still survive. So I knew I could take 80% damage and be fine at the start. You know, I could eat his burst, and then use my burst to kill him kind of thing. 
turns out, no, I couldn't kill an Ali Sham with the rest of Sham with him. And they were getting out of all my traps, getting out of all my buddy's fears. It became just this 15-minute long endurance bullshit. And then at the end of 15 minutes, because at the beginning of the game, that Ellie Shammy got me to 20%, I lose. So it honestly becomes like, all right, instead of instead of us trying to kill each other to win, it's let's, let's, let's just wait out the clock. Let's get, we have to get one person low. Once they're low, get the fuck out of there and just like stay alive and heal and CC and pull fuck and run around like crazy. And this is what I mean, like look at this 2v2 I'm doing right here. Red Pallies, I think, benefit a lot from this resilience buff. Because I've came across a lot of red pallies who take hardly any damage and heal a lot. And because they take less damage, those heals do a lot more. And you can see here, whenever you're reversing a BM Hunter and you don't have the other person to worry about, always just trap their pet. I like to be, I like to be safe. I like to be safe and like not take any chances. So I'll just do stuff like that, like trap their pet. Or even if I it's 2v1 and he's bursting, I might still pop a deterrence just to be extra, extra safe. God, I'm tired. I'm I'm tired because I woke up early just to play play arenas and stuff. And uh, yeah, it's just absolutely. I don't know what they're doing either because it's been a good a good couple hours now, and they've just taken the vendors straight out, and everyone's just kind of standing around the vendors, going like, "What the fuck? I've just done all this shit. I want to buy my gear." And obviously, people are saying they're gonna roll back all the conquest and roll back this, roll back that, and change everything. But it's Blizzard, man. I I don't know what the fuck Blizzard like has done recently. Like, it's become, like, a sort of a... Almost like a laughing stock, almost. Like, the aisle happens. The aisle is buggy as fuck. You can get the mounts by killing totems. There's bugs all over the place. All this kind of shit. And it's laggy. It's bad. It's like, it, it was not a smooth launch by any means. And then there's... Arena comes out, the new season. And then there's bugs within Arena season. I don't know what's happened in 5.4 where Blizzard has kind of just dropped the ball. And the thing is, they're not really implementing anything all that new. Like, it's it's like the 14th arena season or something. It's the 14th one. You'd think they'd have it right by now. <laughs> but no, and oh, I hate this. I hate when arena becomes what you're watching right now. I hate when it becomes a red paladin running around, kiting me, while his partner peels me to stay alive on 10% health. I hate. I Like, I honestly want to, like, leave these kind of arenas. Oh, excuse me. I honestly like just want to leave these arenas because he's just kiting me, kiting me. I'm using everything I can. I'm using my master's call. I'm using my disengages to catch up to him. But it doesn't matter because all he has to do is do that one one little corner and then he's line of sighting me. And with hunters now, I find myself doing a lot less sustained damage. A lot less sustained damage. I do a good burst. In fact, I think I do actually better burst. But my sustained seems a lot shitter. And I think the reason for that is just focus starvation. I think just, you know... I, I get so, like, I look at him, look at his health right now, and I think, need to kill, need to kill, and I arcane shot, arcane shot, kill shot, do this, do that, and then I just run out of focus when he's at, say, 5%, and I can't do anything. I literally cannot do anything without focus while he's at 5%, so I have to stand there and cobra shot, which is the worst thing ever. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys. I'll bring you more soon. Have a good day, have a good life, have a good year, and I'll see you later.